treat me right She said, you can get whatever you want As long as you eat it right, yeah Baby, go turn the lights up I just saw a baby girl in the lights up Yeah, yeah, I'ma knock it What's up, little juice? Welcome back to another Bubble Cut video You guys, I'm in labor I think I'm in labor Oh, fuck Hold on Ah! Hold on, where's my phone? So you guys, all right, it's super early. It's 11.27. Basically, at my doctor's appointment yesterday, they asked me if I wanted to do a membrane sweep. And for those of you who don't know what a membrane sweep, basically, they take like their finger, two fingers, and they go up to your cervix, and they try to separate the placenta with the, I don't know, try to separate something but they like go around like twice and i tell y'all that shit was so fucking painful like low-key more painful than giving birth low-key like it was painful it felt like i was being cut from the inside out so yeah that happened and she told me she was like you're gonna start contracting like tonight now i'm just like okay and i decided to do it basically because i have a um induction schedule today anyway like tonight and i had an induction my first pregnancy but like not meaning to i didn't mean to have an induction but my contractions weren't coming off fast enough so they had to give me pitocin to start it but this time she told me like any remembering so it could be like a more natural way to start it so that i probably don't have to like, get induced and ever since like that happened when i got the membrane sweep I was like walking funny, I felt weird, I felt crampy, I came home, I literally was like irritable, I just had to lay down, and then I just had period cramps, right? At like 2.30, 3 o'clock, that's when I started feeling contractions. And I knew it was a contraction because it was coming like every 10, 15 minutes, and it's like a, it's like you feel it starting to come and then it's like a peak of the contraction and then it goes down so that shit lasts like about like a minute 50 seconds i just try to tough it out until like that shit started like at 2 30 in the morning to like 5 6. i got to sleep for like two hours and then i slept till nine and then once i woke up i started to feel it again i just took a shower and I just called my doctor and I'm just like, listen, I'm getting cramps. Like, am I still scheduled to come tonight? She basically told me like how far apart they are. I should go now to labor and delivery. So that's what we're doing. We already have everything set up. We already have our hospital bag in the car. We already have the car seat. So everything is pretty much ready to go. I'm just fixing up my hair because I did it yesterday. I already washed it. But I'm just doing it right now real quick. I was like, you can't do your makeup. I'm not gonna do my makeup, but I'm gonna pack like, like my little quick makeup routine and I'm gonna just try to do it at the hospital. Cause I wanna look cute with my baby suit. I wanna look like, oh my God, that's mommy. Yeah, I wanna look really cute. But I can't really talk too much. I'm kinda like in pain right now. I just wanna give y'all an update, but I'm gonna get ready to go cause they're already expecting us. Will's getting ran ready. We just, we gotta go, so. Pray everything goes fast and smooth. Let's, let's get it going. All right, y'all. So we have a dilemma. We should have known this before, we, but Rain couldn't come inside the, um, the hospital, and we kind of knew that, but we didn't really know that. I was hoping they would let him come, but the lady just told, I was talking to her right now. She said they don't let like nobody in unless they're like 16 or older. Yeah, due to like. You know, the monkey pox break out and COVID still in effect and stuff like that. So they don't want to be responsible. They don't want to be responsible. Which I understand, which I understand. So I ain't even making a big deal. I just called my cousin to come grab him, grab Rain and come watch him for me. Um, so, and which we don't usually even do. People don't even watch Rain, but, but this is a different time where we needed somebody to help. So I finally made it in the room. I was in the room already. She got comfortable. You see, she in the bed already. I'm set up already. It's the heartbeat. She's about to come in, give me some water, and they gonna put the IV in. Gotta check your vitals. This is warm. Mm -hmm. You have an extra blanket for me? I might need a blanket. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. It's cold in here. <laughs> what is that ice? What ice is that? 
I want some ice. That's what I really want. Oh, you can show them the room. So, a little so I'm gonna say this room is smaller than our last room, right? It is. Yeah. Our other room was a little bit bigger, and the TV was like right there. The couch was like over there. I mean, y'all can always look at the first berth and see yeah. how it was. Yeah. But, but I'm gonna get y'all. It's a comfortable room. I just I'm gonna need this light to go off because this just too bright. bright. It's like a spotlight. That's how it looks when you walk in. There go the pregnant woman right there. <laughs> this is the side where the baby was born. They put the baby over here. Do all that stuff to the baby right there. So this is where I sleep. You know that already. I forgot my damn blanket. My pillow, I mean. My pillow. I my pillow. And then this is the bathroom. Okay, I guess it's fully sanitized. That means it's sanitized. That's a shower. My mom can get in that thing, get in that thing, get clean. Yeah, that's how I look. <laughs> and this is me. Hey. We don't need no big room. We need to get in and out. Yeah, we don't need to get too comfortable. We gotta get what we gotta do and out. I told her I was three. Well, she gotta check to see how much I'm dilating more. I really wanna get birth today. What time is it? What time is it? Oh, it's 1.38. If I could give birth today at like 6 o'clock. <laughs> what you doing? What? How you got all these fruit snacks in here? How you didn't bring those snacks? But so why you got all my fruit snacks? Yours. These are yours. Those are ours. These are yours. I don't eat these. Those are ours. I like the, the blueberries. <laughs> I brought some snacks. Oh my god, don't touch my Snickers then. Don't touch my Snickers. That's my Snickers. That's well, bro, I asked him to get me Snickers. He got two. I'm thinking the two is for me. What am I doing with one Snickers? You're not supposed to have all that damn sugar. How you open this top, Will? Oh. Jesus, thank you. Put that thing up. Damn, my stomach hurt. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, I'm feeling something. You getting excited? Huh. No, no. You don't have to. I came in here. No, I came. And then I check my dilation. I'm so over them checking my shit, bro. I'm so over that shit. You gotta check and see how, much, how far you are. How they checking it with a measuring stick? With their fingers. So what's three inches? What's three centimeters? I don't know how three centimeters. They probably know, like, I don't know. How they know what three centimeters it they is? They trained to do that shit. Spread their fingers, that's like, okay, that's, that's. They probably like, okay, one, two. They probably know how to do it. How? Because the coochie go back to the same place. Am I a fucking doctor? I think they be lying. <laughs> this music is scaring me. Is that coming from the TV? Mm -hmm. It was like spa music. Is that the door? Oh, not right. Now. Last time we gave birth, <laughs> we gave birth. I gave birth. They was playing Baby Boy. They was playing Friday. What else they was playing? It was like all the throwback movies. But yeah, last time I gave birth, it was like a whole different scene because it was raining outside and it was dark because it was nighttime. Remember when we watched this? What is that? What's the, this? Is this the, the jail shit? Yeah. 90 days. Oh, we've seen this. You know, the lady it's got, on Netflix. The lady tried to be a police officer. Yeah, yeah. I mean, oh, she had a police yeah, officer. Yeah, she had to go yeah, in jail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was scared. What's this called? 60 days in jail. Yeah. We've seen this exact one. With that girl, that was. I don't got time for her. <laughs> she she be making me nervous, cause she be nervous. Y'all both be making each other nervous. She be doing a lot. Hello. Hey, ma. Hi, my ma, my love. I'm in the labor and delivery. The what? I'm in the room now. <laughs> That's why I was calling you. Yeah. Did you see Will's post? <laughs> No, she about to check me right now, but yesterday I was between three and four, so let's see. And I've been contracting since like 3 a.m. I've been feeling contractions. Oh, jeez. 
Uh, All right, so keep me posted. I will. When she when she checks, call me back and let me know, okay? All right, we'll yeah, where's Will? Right, right here. here. Hi, Bob. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and where's my baby boy? They didn't let us bring him in. I had a feeling, but. Yeah, where is he though? Um, his Will's cousin. Her name is Aisha. She came to pick him up and bring him back to the house. Okay, perfect. She's gonna stay with him? Yeah. Night. So he's good. I'm upset though. I wanted him here, but whatever. Oh, they don't know. They don't need to. Yeah, that's not gonna happen, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's so stupid. Yeah, he probably would have been in here going like crazy, touching stuff. He would have been all in this yeah. to touch all the cords. <laughs> You're so silly. You really want to know that's not happening. <laughs> 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 Say, what if you don't have nobody to watch your kid? What are you supposed to do? I mean, if you don't have, don't have another kid, if you don't have nobody to watch the first one. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we can't live here, because we don't got nobody over here. We got lucky, though. His, his, your cousin came through, because she, she was busy. Yeah, thank God. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm, I'm anxious, oh but I'm ready to go, because I've been feeling, like, in pain. I just want this shit to be, like, I'm ready yeah, to just keep it going. Yeah. You've passed your due date. She will be pregnant no more. I know. That's fair. They ain't want. They ain't want to get out yet. They want to stay in there. Yeah. Oh, it smells good in here. Hi. Hi. You had a baby last year, didn't you? Year before? Two years ago. Yeah. I'm gonna call you back, mom. Love you. All right. So you started having contractions when? Um, last night at about three o'clock. Okay. Yeah. And they were about every ten minutes. Yeah. Now, what are you feeling right now? Are they getting stronger? It's, it's about the same. It's about when the I same. give her a kiss, she got excited. Yeah, we're not sending you home, don't worry. But we okay. would start giving you Pitocin. If it doesn't like. Well, yeah, you're not. Yeah, no. I'm sure. So they gave the Pitocin right now, y'all. Um, she's having contractions right now. She's starting to feel it. And they said, whenever she's in too much pain, just let them know she won't get the epidural. When you hear it, like when it's like start beating, 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 that's a contraction. And I was like, yeah. She ready, y'all. Uh, put the thumbs up, Mama. She ready. Let's go. This is a way different pregnancy from last time, cause you look way more distressed than the first video. I was stressed. In the first video, like you was going through it. Was I? When you first had, when you first had rain, you was like the video. You was sweating. You was going through it. Alright, y'all. We're gonna do a quick makeup. <laughs> I gotta be really fast because they on my body with, with filming. Cause y'all know they don't they only let you film. I just started my pitocin, so that's gonna like make my contractions come. This is the moisturizer I use, Cerave. Me and Willie both use this. This is my perfume. It's my perfume. This is the fancy perfume. Should I spray some? Yeah, let me spray some. It's not like straight boy in here. But this kind of masculine too, though. You better hurry with your face, goddammit. <laughs> okay, we're going to use some primer. <laughs> we're use the primer. Oop. And I got to pee. God damn it. I'm just put a little bit of primer. Yeah, they're not tripping about my mask. I'm going to just keep my mask down like this. I use the milk makeup. Milk makeup primer. I'm gonna use a little bit of oh, chapstick. Yeah, my lips is dry. You want some chapstick? <laughs> Your lips dry too. <laughs> it's never dry. I got that <laughs> Okay. Chapstick, Dr. Bronix. Um, this is my favorite foundation right here. This is the Charlotte Tilbury. And this is in the shade Warm 8 Warm. I could place my mirror right here. So I'm just put a little bit. I don't even need to use like no um, concealer with this. Oh, I'm starting to feel something. Oh, hold on. Okay, come on, come on. Oh my God. 
hell not. I don't know what the hell that was. That's enough. This is really good coverage. But my face got a lot clearer. I don't know if y'all remember how my face was a couple months ago. But I was breaking out really bad. But I've been taking care of my skin more. I don't sleep with makeup at all. I make sure I wash my face before I go to sleep. It's very important. So yeah, I just use this to like even out my skin tone. If I have like hyperpigmentation, which is only a little bit. But I didn't even eat today. I'm hungry, babe. Hear me? We both didn't eat. I got a Snickers bar. I'm trying to eat that real quick. Oh my god. Okay. That's it with foundation. And then I'm gonna use this powder right here. This is a basically a powder foundation, but I use it to set my face when I'm doing like quick makeup. This is the one size and light two. I'm just gonna take like a fluffy brush like that and just set my foundation with this all over. So I'm gonna use my eyes, set my whole face with it. You nervous, babe? No, are you? Huh? No. You say am I? Yeah. Not really. I'm kind of nervous to feel that pressure. Cause that shit kind of hurts, but I can get through it again. For the doctor. All right, so what are we looking at right here, y'all? And then I use a small brush and do it underneath my eyes. And it's a light powder, so it's good. All right, that's it. Damn, different dedication. For my brows, I'm gonna just use this like tinted brow gel. It's from Kosas and it's air it's called air brown and dark brown and i'm just gonna use this for my brows and just add some color in there just brush them out but this is all i use for my brows i've been going for like the more natural brow look so, lately okay like that and then i try to elongate it just a little bit i see the difference it's just a little bit darker Cavity what the check. fuck are you doing? Cavity check. You gonna check my cervix? Check your cervix. I think it's down there. Where the oil at? The oil? For my stomach? You gotta slap that petroleum jelly on that fingers. <laughs> they have a glob of oil going in that cool out. <laughs> like, what the hell all that for? They don't usually do that. She put a big glob of that lubrication on that motherfucker. They don't usually do that all the time. Sometimes they just like do the finger and like. You wouldn't know. I mean, yeah, by you now. You wouldn't know about the finger leather. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now I'm about to be done. See how fast that was? Now I'm gonna use some blush real quick. There's a tart blush and the light is a small one. And I'm just gonna use a blush brush. When you're doing minimal makeup, blush will make it look like put everything together. It'll make everything look like nice, natural, but still like you have like a little bit of makeup, but not really. It just brings life back to your face. So I love blush. I like to just bring it up on my cheek mode, keep it underneath. I also put it on my nose, gives you that little flushed look. Like that. Do the same thing on this side. You starting to trend right now. What? I'm telling you, everything we do is that trend. Everybody will be trying to do their makeup tutorials in the living room. People, I've seen, uh, actually, no, I haven't I seen. I've never seen nobody do that. Do this? Never seen nobody do their makeup in the living room. Um, Julie had her makeup done while she was in the living room. She, she was getting her, her makeup done. She was getting it done? Yeah, by her friend. For real? And she had like a full beat, like not like this. It was like a full ass beat. She videotaped it. I think so. I think she posted it on, on YouTube. For real? Yeah. Damn. Yeah, she did that, and she gave birth mad quick too. 
she was ready okay that's really it damn i have highlighter but i don't have a i don't have a brush for it i don't have a brush for my highlighter so i ain't gonna use that i have mascara i'm gonna just put a little bit i don't want to cry it off and then have mascara on my face i'm gonna just put it on the top top lashes just a little bit this is Stila. Stila. What's this called? Huge. Huge Extreme Lash. And I'm gonna just put a little bit of powder on my eyelids. Just a little bit. Yeah, that's all I could really do right now. Um, or I could put, um, I have some highlighter. I'm gonna just use it on my fingers. This is the cookie by Benefit. I can use it on my fingers and just put a little bit on my cheekbones. Oh, and there's highlighter in here too. Just a little bit. Hold on, no. Oh, I'm feeling, oh, hold on. Oh. You okay? Oh, fuck this shit painful. Oh my god, damn. Okay, it's coming down, it's coming down, it's coming down, it's coming down. Okay. okay. Damn, bro. It's that, it's that peak. When it's that peak, that should be hitting different. But yeah. That's my makeup. It's very quick, natural. Um, do I need more blush? I could put more blush. You think I need more blush? You think I'm fine? Oh, you look good. That's a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna put some. Should I put some lip liner on? You think so? I don't think I have it in here. Nah. I'm not gonna put no lipstick on. I have lip gloss, like this color lip gloss, but I'm not gonna use it. I'm just gonna keep the chapstick on. That's just probably better. My lips probably gonna get dry. Right, I'm done. All right, and that's the quick makeup tutorial. <laughs> you have to shut it off real quick. They came in here on that bullshit. That's it right now. She gave you a little quick tutorial. Now we gotta let the processes begin. Let the and let the baby come. It's been about an hour right now. About an hour or two. We are currently halfway in the bag. The, the toasting bag, we're not really all the way even fully done. We're halfway in there, but my mind's starting to feel her contractions getting stronger and stronger. She doesn't have any epidural in her right now, so she's taking the pain like a big girl, but right now she just um, says she's feeling a little pain. Mm. How long you think you're gonna be able to take it? Like the pain without the medicine? It's just, it's not like unbearable, unbearable. It's just, it's getting now frequent. So that's that. Yeah. All right, y'all, so <laughs> mama can't have none of this right now. She going through what she going through, but you know this time we're a little different. I got chicken patties, you know what I'm saying? Chicken patty them, chicken patty them. Festival, mm-hmm, festival, good festival. Extra jerk, mm-hmm. Need that nice and sweet. See it there? Oh, look at this. Let me show you the jerk. Oh, hold on. This way. Let me show you this. Show you the plizzy. Show you the plizzy. Don't get glizzy when I show you the... Yeah! Yes! <laughs> Steamed cabbage. Rice and peas. Jerk off the real grill. Mm, mm, mm. And I complimented myself with a nice, you know, cola. Damn. I'm gonna do right. Damn, I'm not going through this stress while well, I'm living my best. All right, we're just going to say that right there. All right, y'all, so right now, Mama has the push ball. I'm not going to show y'all exactly what's going on. The, I'm not going to peanut ball, <laughs> the push ball. The <laughs> peanut ball, the push ball. They came in here, they broke her water. They stabbed her with the chopstick. a chopstick. The same shit that I use for my sushi. <laughs> Why are they using that for sushi? She's five centimeters. And how about us? 
Yeah. You got five more to go. And I'm not feeling up there right now because I have epidural. Five minutes later. You want them on the table? Yeah, you can just open them and I'll pull them out.
than one now. Okay, pull those legs back. Push like this. Baby's coming out right now. Three, harder, 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 harder. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Push again. And hard. Push again. Hard. Push again. Hard. Push again. Hard. Push again. And hard. More, more, Olivia. Four, more, 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 more. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. And again. And again. Push hard. Two, three, four, five, push it out. Seven, eight, we're getting nine, hard. Ten. So we're going to get baby hard, right? Sick, then I'll sit with you. I'll